Hey fitness warriors, this is Irma here at the tip of the week. Just wanted to share, make sure that you're uh, basically on track. If you haven't seen that scale move, percentage of body fat is staying the same, then I wanna make sure that you stay calm and cool. Pause, clarify and decide what you're doing. Make sure you're t t drinking tons of water and you need to stay positive in here. It's a mental fitness challenge, basically. Um, I'm basically doing a lot of reading um, and I'm, I'm, I just uh, discovered that in life, there's a pattern that people consistently have, always have errors with. And what we've discovered in the world, the three top things that people consistently have problems with is finance, relationships, and the physique, your body. And it was really interesting because it makes all the sense in the world. Um, I, uh, I'm a disciplinarian. I teach love, accountability, and, uh, and truth. And so when I heard about that, it makes all the sense in the world. And when you're healthy, everything wins. You have more fun, you have your better finance, you make better decisions, you meet better people, you're more positive, you're not so negative. So they all correlate together. And so when I see a big protruding belly, it's because a person's not taking care of themselves and not loving themselves. And that's not being richful in life. That's not taking care of yourself. And there's gonna be a bumpy road in your life. So my, my tip to you is discipline is a simple, a few simple, a few simple, a few simple uh, rules practiced, excuse me, a few simple rules repeated every day. Again, discipline is a few simple rules repeated every day. Error is a few errors in judgment repeated every single day. So when I give my clients rules and regulations, it's for those that follow do well. And what I studied is people that are Olympic champions, people that are outstanding Michael Jordans, the Kirk, uh, uh, basically the outstanding golfers, um, those elite, those that consistently do the basics are the most outstanding. So practice your rules because you don't want to repeat error every day. And when you practice your rules, then your finance gets better, you make better decisions, and relationships blossom. Uh, one thing that I'm doing right now is uh, writing books because I love helping and opening the, up the mind and opening up the spirit. And uh, I want to make sure that you understand if you have trouble always trying to find out where the truth is in life, and you have a battle with truth, I always say relationships are something that I love to build. I love open and honest relationships through communications. That's one of our core values. So a question to my family members, if you have ever got into fit, uh, uh, an actual argument with a fa family member, a brother, sister, a mother, how has that ever happened? Has that happened? Absolutely. What happens? You might cuss, you might say something you don't mean, and then it may be a day, it might be a few months, I don't know how you react, but with my family, we apologize, and then we get back together, we hug, we clap it out, and it's typically 99% miscommunication. But on the other hand, what society is right now, what the Western culture is now, that the louder a person is online, that there's the truth. It's like a person coming into a restaurant and yelling as loud as they can, and that's one of the rudest things to do. And so what I say is, would you ever get your family's information and put it online and air their, air their laundry online and bash them online? A mother that helped you out, would you make them feel awful even though you just miscommunicated? No, right? That's how you know someone is erratic because if you have an open, honest communication, two human beings can communicate. We have intelligence. We have open, honest relationships. We're the, the smartest people on earth. We just have to open our minds and open our hearts and let the ego go. And once we let the ego go, relationships blossom. So these are the three factors that people have consistent patterns with. And again, if you wanna know truth, follow truth. Philosophy always leads to truth. Question truth. Know that I'm here to let you know that I am outstanding and I build outstanding cultures.